Remember us, we're the Lees from Milton Keynes. I'm Daniel, this is my dad Mark, and my grandfather Claude. Last time we were here, we impressed the bikers with our freshly caught crayfish. But we made a bit of a mess of the hairy how-to. And this time we're gonna branch out even further and try and prove to the bikers that there's more to us than just crayfish. Oh. Welcome back to our little biker handout. Yeah. So you're not tempted to bung in a few crayfish in tonight's dish? Well, it's funny you should say that. You did think you might put one in, didn't I you? Did. But no, yeah. we're, we're going to try something completely different to show you that we can cook other than crayfish. Right, can't wait. Look forward to it, Mark. Yeah. Now, let's get the quarterfinals of the game. Now, time for round two, the family favourite dish. Both our teams will cook us one of their favourite meals, but they'll only have 30 minutes in which to do it. Families, don't forget what we'll be judging you on. Teamwork? Flair, presentation, and taste. So, families, let's go to the kitchens and see what you're cooking. So, Mark, time. what are you going to cook tonight? We're cooking cannon of lamb mm -hmm. cut into medallions, uh, a cream leek, and a pomme fondant. Right. And then to finish it off, a port and chocolate sauce. Right. And these are the ingredients. Yes, you've got uh, your 100% cocoa chocolate. Yep. Leeks, which goes with the butter. Yep. And the Stilton and the potato is cut into a round shape. And what made you choose this dish? Roast lamb is one of our favourites. It's really our Sunday lunch in half an hour, if you like. Right. Uh, a twist. I look forward to it. Thank okay. you. So, families, your time starts now. Get <laughs> cooking. <laughs> oh, cooking for a place in the quarterfinal, dude. Now, as with all wild meat, Squirrel needs to be cooked longer so it becomes tender. Chanterelle mushrooms have a slightly peppery flavour, but will this be a challenge for the verdants to bring that flavour through? Now, the lees, the fondant potatoes, the pom fondant, it should be golden on all sides and soft in the centre. But I think that's a tough ask in 30 minutes. Yes, absolutely. Both the blue cheese and port have strong flavours, so the family need to get the balance of the two just right for the combination to work. Should you go and have a look? How do, Claude? Fine, yes. what, what have we got you doing? I'm doing the uh, onion and oh, leek yeah. sauce with white wine and stilton cheese and cream. Right. Yeah. So, Daniel, what are you doing? Are you on the fondants? I am indeed. Are you worried about getting them cooked on time? Um, <clears throat> no, I'm reasonably confident. Don't you? I think we've, we've done it three or four times now. It's been fine every time. You've been practicing. Been practicing indeed. Yes. Just hopefully it'll all come together today, I suppose. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Because we had somebody else on before who did fondant potatoes and they failed. But they didn't parboil them. No pressure. <laughs> okay, different just... dishes, aren't they? Yeah, very. Good. I mean, the Lee's dish, I think it's going to depend on them getting the flavours absolutely perfect. Yeah. But so did their crayfish ravioli. Yes. And they did it. Yes, they did. There's a good palate, amongst the gentlemen. The Verdans got the flavours right, got them balanced, so we'll see how Sounds we do it. Sounds very ambitious. I think it is a bit yes. ambitious yeah. because that squirrel's going to have to be cooked to mm -hmm. perfection. Mm -hmm. I just wonder if the ladies in that family cook. Well, you wouldn't want to, would you, because the three lads are pretty good. Jackie? Yes? You're married to Claude? Yes. Do, do you cook at home or do you leave it all to Claude? No, we, we both cook. Yes? Yeah, um, yeah did, I can Did you cook. teach him everything he knows? Oh, yes, yes. <laughs> <laughs> and do you go crayfishing as well? I do, yes. And I fell in the river. Have you? <laughs> yeah. You must live on the edge in your family. We do. It's so exciting. Yes. <laughs> you didn't go sheep rustling for the meat, did you? I did. <laughs> Families, you are halfway through. Fifteen minutes left. Halfway. Look here, who's shouting for reds? <laughs> who's shouting for blues? Fifty-fifty. <laughs> Can you get me the little plate, please? Lord Mark and Daniel are having a confab. What's that coming out? Well, I've just, just used it to get some flavour into the plate. Right, so using the trimmings yeah. from the lamb to get some flavour. Yes. 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 Excellent. So you, you're kind of part of this great cooking dynasty now, Daniel. I've just been following what my dad's been telling me, really. Do you want to be a chef when you leave uni? No, no. No? No, I, I enjoy cooking, but I don't think I, don't think I want to be a chef. Right. Hey. 
I nearly had your bandana off there, Mark. <laughs> no wonder he's got no air. Yeah, what? Yeah. What's the a discussion going on in the mm -hmm. Reds. Mm -hmm. Families, you have three minutes left. <laughs> the Blues are starting to plate up now. Yeah, how's are the Reds? Good, 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 good. Now, families, this is absolutely critical. This dish has to be the best you've ever cooked it. Don't forget what we're judging you on. Presentation, teamwork, taste and flair. I think both teams are cutting it to the wire, but yes. they're very much under control. Very good. Use every second of the time that you have to make sure it's presented the best it can possibly be. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Time's up. Stop there, family. Stop there. Families, can you bring your meals back? Bring the dishes over, please, families. Mm. Amen. Thank so, you Mark, very much. can you headline your dish for us? Yep. Cannon of lamb with fondant potato and cream leeks with right. a yep, port and chocolate sauce. Right, nice and presented. You. Is it cooked? Yes. Yep. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, families. Go back to your kitchen. Back Thank to your you. Kitchens, please. Thank you very much. Oh, that was a Bobby Dazzler. Well, the Verdans, it was certainly autumnal. Oh, yes. Like, like forest floor. Yeah. With a squirrel perch on the top. <laughs> <laughs> it was quite spectacular in its execution. I kind of got frustrated with the plate of food because there was too much of it. Yes. And it wasn't clear what the elements were. No. The squirrel. <sighs> it was tough. It was tough, because it wasn't cooked long enough. Whereas, I think the Lee's dish, the lamb was cooked well. It was, yeah. The sauce was beautiful. It was very intense. It was. But the texture it was good, because it wasn't cloying. And it had a really good top note oh, to right. it as well. Claude's leeks. They were they superb. They were and good. really beautifully presented. I think you know the yep. one. Like yourself, Mark. <laughs> Thank you. It is cooked. It's more like a chicken nugget than tempura. <laughs> <laughs> well, families, that's your final round over. Si and I need to go away to discuss the dishes, and when we come back, we'll announce the winner. Well, mate, I think that's quite an easy one, really. The Lees, it was, it was chunks. It was. You know, it was soft chicken nuggets. Yeah. The Verdans, I thought they did really quite well. And the sauce tasted OK, actually. Yeah, it did. The Lee's sauce was too much soy sauce. Yes, it was. was. overpowering. Interestingly, the noodles seemed to stick together on the Lee's more than the Verdans. The Verdans was kind of a free-running noodle, if you like. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. I know, I know where we're going to go, do you? Absolutely, yeah. yep. <laughs> so, for the result, we have to look back to the family favourite dish. Now, there were two very, very different dishes. One quite traditional, and, and one very elaborate. The Verdans, we, we felt that the flavours in your dish, there was too much going on. It was quite confusing. And also, the, the squirrel was tough. However, the Lee's dish, it was classic, but it, it was superb in taste, flavour and presentation. And for that reason, we've given the family favourite dish round to the Lee's. <laughs> Which makes... <laughs> the Lee's... The overall winners of tonight's cook-off. Congratulations. Thank you. And congratulations to the...